Hello healers! Thanks for clicking in this video. Welcome to your reading today. And I had the feeling to do this one um, to help you out with anything that could be blocking your life at the moment, anything that's stopping you to continue your path, your growth. And uh, this is going to really be about uh, uh, what is blocking your life, what is blocking your blessings at the moment, all right? So, um, like always, uh, my details and the card details, anything that you can see here at the moment will be on the description below. Thanks for clicking again, thanks for subscribing, leave your messages, uh, let me know if it resonates with you. And um, always, I always say, go with your first uh, intuition, the gut feeling regarding the crystals and the, and the pile of cards, all right? So just concentrate on what you can uh, uh, remove or what you need to know to unblock your life at the moment. Concentrate on that and uh, choose from crystal number one, two or three. Okay, so just concentrate a little bit, choose one and I'll leave the timestamp on the description as well. Thank you very much for watching. Hi group number one, if you chose this beautiful green crystal, I'll leave it here to help us out. And uh, I'll open a few cards for you, all right? And um, some are tarot cards, some oracle cards. It's just what, what I prayed on and I was compelled to choose, all right? So like I, I prayed on them and I mixed them. I did not choose them. The higher powers chose them for you, okay? And I have opened four cards here for you. So I have this are the tarot cards. This is the Ace of Pentacles and the Seven of Pentacles. I also have a couple of Oracle cards here for you. don't know if you can see them all. This is if you get nervous, focus on service. And this one, you are a powerful light worker. I'm going to save one here for later. Is, yeah, I'm just trying to make sure you can see them all. I'll read them for you anyway. So just to, to start here really what I can tell you is that there has been some offers to you uh, like uh, of something that you really wanted and um, you have worked hard for it and um, also you you can see the flu the fruits of your labor uh, but you are at the moment thinking what is next, right? So you're thinking with this card here, with the with the Seven of Pentacles, it's really like you have done some hard work towards what you want, but you have seen some results, but you're also thinking now, what's the next, what's next for me? So it looks like you have... Uh, worked on something for a while. It could be that you are doing a type of job that you you enjoyed, but you're still looking for something new. And there is a there is an offer coming to you, right? But what is really important here regarding these two cards? I'm gonna read them for you. Okay. Um, the first one here is uh, you are a powerful light worker. It is safe for you to be powerful. Your spiritual power brings great blessings in loving service to the divine. And the other one here is, if you get nervous, focus on service. Put your, your entire intention on answering the question, how can I make the world a better place? And the law of attraction will automatically take care of your needs. This is a very powerful card. I will actually put it here in the front. Hopefully you can see. What I see here is that it, you feel like you, you are a bit stuck on what to do next. So you're like in doubt of, you, you have some done some good work, but it's like, what do I do next? You feel like a higher calling. That's my feeling, right? And uh, you you can be certain of that with this card here. You are a powerful light worker. So I don't know if you're already in this area or if you if you're looking to move on to 
any area regarding uh, helping others, a light worker, a service um, around your area, communi community, or something that is a light worker, something to do with the divine. If you if you have any calling for that, I have a feeling here because you are a powerful light worker. These cards, the angels, the higher power are telling you, you're already a light worker. Maybe you're, you're not on that area, but you are feeling like you should go. Because you're here with this card here. It's showing that you are thinking, what do I do next? I'm very happy with what I have done so far, but what next? And here is a, is a beautiful offer for you to do something in this area. That's my feeling. And uh, if you get the nervous, focus on service. Service is here again. And here is a very powerful question. How can I make the world a better place? What can you do? What kind of service are you stopping at the moment to do because of this uh, questioning of what to do? It's like you're a bit, you stopped a bit at the moment just thinking. But don't be afraid. You're on the right path. If this offer comes to you regarding uh, working, light worker, in, in a way of like a, a service, you will know what I'm talking about. If this is resonating with you, please let me know on the, on the comment. Because you, you, you are a light worker. So it's showing here that you have some divine um, connections uh, and work to do to help others. And there is an offer coming to you. If it's not there already, maybe you already received this offer and you're not sure on what to do. This is really showing you that this is the right way. You will be so happy in this area because it's your calling. That's my feeling. You have a calling to become a light worker. And I actually have another card here, the last card, which is lovely because it's the cards which I really like with the two sides, with, you know, when affirmation messages from the archangels and the gemstones, I read for you. Uh, this is, um, do you feel like you are fulfilling your soul purpose? Do you know what your strengths are? It's time to become the person you are meant to be. Align yourself with a strong sense of self and actualize your full potential. L live up to your dreams, desires and contract and radiate your excellence. Very, very powerful card here. Really, really telling you to, you know, this is so connected here. It's unbelievable. Um, so it's really about, do you feel like you, you are fulfilled that you have, uh, your, your life purpose, your soul purpose, you know, that's my feeling here. It is that you have a soul purpose here to become this light worker because you may have done other types of jobs that you were happy about. You did a good job, but it's a really on a point that you like what's next so what is blocking you at the moment is like you're not sure i feel like you were not sure maybe that you wh what was next for you and if this is really a clear message for me that you are a light worker you have some service higher powers guiding you to do a different service right now and that will be a fulfillment of your soul purpose which is really really powerful really beautiful uh you know what else can you do align with the higher powers ask directions you know this is a this is already an offer or a something already that you have received or you will receive towards this area that it's use your soul it's really your sole purpose here and you will be able to uh, be very very happy with this because it will be so fulfilling and you will know that you are on the right path I do have another side here which is the Archangel Ariel uh, an, a prayer affirmation however you want to call and this is for you so it is safe for me to shine my light brightly I am self-confident I recognize my self-worth worth. it is easy for me to set boundaries my internal brilliance shined. I have the courage to be all that I can be. Beautiful, beautiful affirmation here for you. Right? I hope you can see that. It's really about aligning yourself with your life purpose here. That's that's my feeling with these cards. And it's so, so clear that you, you are a light worker. Like I said, you may have already received this offer or it's on the way for you. It's a change coming. It's a beautiful change. 
for you to become really, uh, you know, self-worthy. You know, recognize all your power, all your plantation, because you have so much power and ways to help others. So, if say what was blocking you here, it's just this, this, this question of what to do next. It's like you didn't know, but I'm telling you, this is very clear here. This is a beautiful offer, and it's it's also including really abundance offer as well. So don't worry if you're thinking about your uh, uh, money wise uh, how will you be able to do this job this is this is an offer that is going to come with everything that you need and you know regarding money regarding anything that you need uh, to fulfill this um you know this this path it's a really beautiful path for you here and i hope this resonates with you if it does like i said let me know this is really really clear here for me that your path is, is really opening. If anything was blocking you, it was because you didn't know uh, what to do next. It was just questioning what to do next. Next, And this is really clear. You are a light worker. Okay? Your life path needs to be fulfilled. And you have so much potential. And you can help so, so many people. Which is really lovely. So, if it, again, if it resonates with you, let me know. And... Um, Group number one, this is a beautiful path. I really hope you take it and I wish you all the best. Thank you for watching. Group number two, if you chose this beautiful, beautiful yellow crystal, I'll leave it here to help us too. What is blocking you? What is stopping your blessings? I have a few cards here that I'm going to open for you. All right. So I have here the, hope you can see, the Two of Pentacles and the Three of Pentacles. I'm putting like this because I have bigger ones here, bigger cards. And I have another card here which is Release. I'm going to read it, the message in a bit. And Clear Yourself. All right. So I hope you can see what I wanted to tell you straight away. Group number two is that you've been um, juggling, you know, trying to balance a few things at the moment and um, trying to get to to some somewhere, right? So it's like um, trying to balance everything you can at the moment. You have done some hard work and you have some recognition of this hard work that you have done. All right. But I feel like you need to clear yourself. You have uh, at the moment, you see here the message is uh, ask the angels to release any toxic energies that you may have absorbed. So I feel like there is some cleansing to do uh, with yourself, with your mind. Uh, depending of what you've been trying to juggle at the moment, if it's work or if it's family, you know, relationships. And here is release, which is work with Archangel Michael to let go of what no longer serves you or your purpose. So my feeling here is that you have uh, doing some hard, you have been doing some hard work here with this Tree of Pentacles. You have been uh, uh, getting some recognition recognition of that which is great but you have been uh, juggling uh, too many things at the moment with uh, like I say it could be family or, or work and um, you needed to clear yourself you need to release some of this burden you need to you have the Archangel Michael here or you know however you want to call the universe the higher powers they are here to help you if you just ask for help because you need to let go of what no longer serves you so you don't need to be juggling all the time what is blocking your i feel like you have too much on your plate um this is really being able to you you are being able to do it right like i said you've been you have your recognition your, your hard work is being paid off but it can take a toll uh, depending of how long this go on for right and uh, it's hard to to focus and to really go for your higher purpose, your your what you really want to do in life. So, and you, I feel like you need to do this clearing. 
you see you have to ask he's asking he ask the the angels to release any tox, uh, uh, toxic energies so depend how long you're doing this it, it can be taking a toll on you like i said so it's time to release and and some of this burden to the higher powers ha ask for help around you sometimes the the you know the higher powers the angels they send help and we say no to help sometimes because we don't know they actually uh, coming from above and that was our time to to actually release a little bit and continue with our higher purpose so i feel like um they some toxin toxic relationships or toxic uh, work relationships it could be this is related to work as well and um this is not a bad card both card both of them are good cards i just feel like connecting with everything and we're talking about what is blocking you it's really about um juggling uh, uh too many things and you it's time to release a little bit and have a, a bit of a, a clear path of what you you want to do uh, focus a little bit more on yourself on one thing at a time maybe or you know that you will be able to concentrate and give your best to that and uh, ask the like i say the higher powers meditation time for yourself just don't let it go for too long all right i do have this other card here which are the ones from the archangels and the, the gemstones that i like very much because they do have the two sides the prayer on the back the first side here is are you trying to reach a goal and keep getting pulled off course maintain your focus identify and release distractions keeping you from moving forward Visu visualize your future know that you can easily work through any issues that may arise success is yours and the other side here the prayer the affirmation from archangel michael is i am always safe and protected my business is a great success and endures all economic cycles with ease it is easy for me to remove obstacles from my path i am able to handle challenges beautiful powerful card here for you again is telling you to focus you see concentrate on one thing that i feel like this is this juggling could be taking you off the 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 purpose like it's, it's saying here for you clear anything that is no longer serve you and and so you can actually follow your purpose and find your way so what is blocking you here it's really taking too much into your plate i feel and it's time to release a little bit focus so you it's 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 time to focus on yourself and find your real purpose and uh you know be able to move forward so if anything is blocking you here like i said what the it's really about what's blocking you it's about too many things and it's time to let go a little bit so you'll be able to focus on yourself focus on what you really want make your life a little bit easier success is yours so it's there for you what you want your purpose is there for you it depends of how much you can take at the, at, at the moment and i feel like it's time to let go of a few things clear yourself your mind even your 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 work to hours of work i feel like it could be relationships as well depend of your situation you know uh, but it's time to focus a little bit uh, on yourself release a little bit and be able to move forward through your life purpose success is yours remember you have it it's right there for you just um, you know see what no longer serves you what you need to cut off your life and uh, it's time to move forward all right so group number two if this has resonate with you let me know leave a comment send me an email if you want uh, more private information that's fine and um, i hope this resonate with you and help you in a little bit on your on your life purpose so thank you very much for watching group number three if you chose this beautiful blue crystal i'll leave it here to help us out as well what is blocking you at the moment i have few cards for you Five of Pentacles and the Six of Pentacles. 
it's here for you to see that I'll put it here because I have more cards I have shield yourself and I have Archangel Michael here to assist you beautiful cards all right I'm just trying to to have space for all of them here because there's another one and I'll just focus on these four ones first so straight away I can tell you group number three what is blocking you this 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 five of pentacles is really like um, a self-pity not seeing the big picture and um, feeling left out right so you know your situation if if it's like work or family or relationships whatever it is you you were feeling left out and uh, but you couldn't see that maybe the help was there you just uh, didn't see you passed through the help right in front of you but because you were feeling this self pity and um, you didn't want to see any other any any other help that would come along but this six of pentacles any five to six when you get something like that it's always like a um, uh, progress it's like moving forward I can see you did move or you are moving forward this this feeling and and there is a balance there is a, th a, a give and take um, balance situation here that is coming that you very you, you're being very good or you or that is coming to you to be very good at balancing everything so you you will move away from this if you if you had been feeling that way and you have this balance coming towards you so it could be in a relationship or I feel more relationship it could be family or a partner and um, or even like you're single and you're looking for someone and you're feeling left out but this is this balance is coming to you so you don't need to worry about feeling this way for too long because it's it's, it's not it's yeah, um, this is really like a way for you to move forward as well with this these readings and um, to tell you that you don't need to feel this way because there is a balance co balance coming towards you and you you have here the message to shield yourself which is protect yourself from harsh or fear-based energies by envisioning a cocoon of healing light surrounding you this is a beautiful way for you to heal yourself and uh, think like because many times they say oh heal yourself like how what can you actually do um, this is like a very simple easy way just imagine this light surrounding you release any fears any any self-pity any bad feelings that you could have uh, or someone have could have caused you that as well it doesn't mean that you did that on your own that happens you know and uh, but it's time to release that and imagine this this light surrounding you releasing this fear this these bad feelings it's slowly you know repeat every day and you will be able to release and uh, like I said that there is some good balance coming to you and uh, there is a message here that the Archangel Michael as well you are working very closely with this powerful Archangel who's protecting and guiding you through this situation so Archangel Michael is here very very strong if you don't believe in the angels it's really about the higher powers sending you love the creation and, and support because I feel like there was some hard feelings and um, like I say self-pity feeling left out this was this is what was blocking you right It's very very clear here uh, this card has a heavy energy like uh, not seeing but you, you're not seeing the big picture you have Archangel Mike you have the higher powers on your side helping you just very very close to you guiding you and you know through this situation and here it is here are your blessings here is the give and take that it could be on a relationship that's gonna be more balanced could be the work could be family it's gonna become more balanced and it's not gonna be only one-sided because I feel like you were feeling left out and one-sided you are the only one giving this is not gonna happen here anymore right this is it is, is a lovely balance you give and you and you take as well so you could be with someone that is was not understanding you and not being uh, very loving or being there for you and you're giving and not receiving but this is moving 
maybe it's moving to a different person but or the same person that has grown from that uh, that state of mind but it's showing here very clear that the balance is coming so shield yourself clear yourself from this feeling this self-pity this left out and and work with archangel michael the higher powers they are here to help you and they are already there look around ask for help they are closer than you can imagine so i do have another card here for you which i really like because are the two side cards that i i like to use from the archangel my archangels and gemstones the first side here is saying uh you know the message here for you is do you want to improve and trust your intuition activate your third eye and exercise your sensory gifts you receive messages from the divine all the time it is now time to notice the signs interpret them and use the higher guidance to create ease in your life very very connected here beautiful card and just just so you know i don't choose the cards i pray on them and, and i shuffle them and the higher powers create choose them for you this is really a clear message saying that they are sending messages and signs uh, to you to show you that they are there to help you pay attention to them do you want to open this this third eye and and your your chakras and understand where is the higher power coming they are there all the time trying to help you don't close your eyes the help is there is showing here in this card and this card is really beautiful and the balance is here for you waiting for you as well which is lovely so don't don't close your eyes they are there meditate stop stop a little bit imagine that clear light coming and helping you to move take away any bad feelings and clear yourself listen listen to the higher powers archangel michael is here helping you and you will be able to move forward and go to a more balanced state of mind and period in your life all right beautiful one and i have here on the other side um, prayer affirmation from the Archangel Raziel the message here it's for you to repeat right I am extremely intuitive my spirit guides and angels send me messages all the time I am grateful for the divine guidance my mind is clear and all knowledge is available I awaken my consciousness I am calm I am at peace beautiful beautiful affirmation here for you guys Hopefully you can see and you can take a screenshot, repeat there, use it. You can uh, be very intuitive and you can really see the guides helping you. Always say in a present tense, doesn't matter how you're feeling right now, you already have that clear focus of how you, you will feel. It's future for us, but there is no present, past and future for the higher powers. I always say that. So always say present tense, I am calm, I am at peace, I, I, you know, I awaken my consciousness. I feel like there is a really beautiful path here for you, together with the higher powers and angels, like being able to hear more and uh, be more intuitive. You just needed to allow yourself to move on from any, any hard feelings, clear yourself, you know, take time to meditate and feel um, the presence of the... The archangels, the, the, the higher powers, they're trying to assist you. You will be able to start listening and, and feeling. And in time, in really, really, no, uh, really quick time, you will see the difference. You know, use this, this meditation, this, this technique here of shielding yourself. Very important. If it came this clear here, it's because you needed to clear that energy and it's time for you to move forward there is a beautiful beautiful future here path waiting for you much more balanced more calm and and happy so i hope this has resonated with you group number three if anything was blocking you it can be removed and it's really really uh, easy here for you all the the help is available for you and I hope if it did resonate with you, let me know on the comments. Uh, you can always send me a private email if you prefer. And I'm, I'm really happy to assist. So thank you very much for your time. And I hope this has helped you in, in some way. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.